back to the model. And now, in first, we should understand that we want to link the database and the model. So we have to have one unique uh, property or parameter to link the element, any, any element in the model, and the element in the database. In database, we have model element ID, and we will use it because we, we have elements with this particular ID in model. Okay, let's take this one, and let's find it. Go to find elements, find elements, then use the category of element ID, value, And find all. And here it is. And we will work with the uh, tables, with tables, and we will get the information from the database about the company, about the person who is using this table now. And how to make a link? And first, you should know that we can make a link between the particular file, this file, and we can make the special. Database which can be linked to any kind of file. In first time, let's do it with the first with this particular file. Go to the home and file options. And here we have a data tools. Go there and let's make a new data tool. New one and let's name it table. This is the name of the link. The name of the link with database. We can press OK and this all. Now we have special link, but we haven't choose haven't chosen the table, haven't chosen the database and the and the data. Go to edit it. And now first we should choose a driver. Because we we are using the access now, let's uh, try the Microsoft Access driver, this one. Then we should you we should get the database, go to setup. And then let's let's find it. Select and we're in our materials, material nine, and this database is our one. Press OK and OK. And now we have the path to it and the and the file. And now we have the database and the driver and the name of the link. But we do not get uh, something new, some new properties. You can check it. Now we can yeah, you can activate it. Data tools, let's activate it. And no active data. And so we have to set it in the next video.